Gloucester, Massachusetts, October 30th, 2001, 2100 hours. Boston Police Department. Name, Fisk. First name, Charles. Date of birth, February 17th, 1944. Presumed date of death, October 24th, 2001. <laughs> private eye owns a double barrel shotgun as a characteristic excellent <laughs> ethnology professor characteristic doesn't know her dad how is that a fucking characteristic <sighs> I feel like they're just making you pick between do you own a do you owning a double barrel shotgun as a characteristic or not knowing your dad in the dark alone in the dark owning a double barrel gun Aline, are you okay? How could I be okay? What was that thing? What the heck's going on How here? How could I be okay? I don't even know my own dad. At the moment, dad. I've got no God idea. Sakes. Listen, I want out of here, right now. Look, don't panic. I'll think of something. Where exactly are you? On the roof of some kind of manor. I nearly got myself killed. I'm really scared. Please do something. I landed in some woods about 100 yards from the manor. Can you see me? See you? How could I? Help me for Christ's sake. Turn on your flashlight. Okay. I can see you now. Okay. I see you too. Here's what we'll do. Try and get inside the manor, then find a place to hide. I'll come looking for you. How long will that take? I don't know. As little time as I can. What? Aline, I'll come for you. And that's a promise. That's a promise. We'll find your dad together alone in the dark. Finding your father. 
Even this and that voodoo religion. He had written a brilliant doctorate, not a thesis, a brilliant doctorate. of all evil has come to the world since the arrival of modern man.
of saving. First aid kit. Walkie talkie. By the way. Examine it. Magical pen in hand. I can use it to save my progress at any moment. Oh my god. No, no, don't move. Don't move. Leave me be. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Who did this to you? This island is a hell. Not men. Beasts, flee! Get out of here in any way you can. How did you get here? The boat. Last shipment. He shot everyone. Look, just try to stay calm. You've got a gun. I'm needing you some bullets. I'll go and find help. But you'll die like everyone else. Run. I'll be back. Fantastic. Oh, 
There's surely a way. <coughs> we'll find that way. This green. There's the way. Get in there! Get down in there! Okay, so are you trying to say not go this way? Shoot it, is that the answer? Violence. Oh my god. This one's for you, little crocodilo. Bullets. Phosphorus cartridges. It's all this like alchemy bullets. The triple barrel shotgun. Hell yeah. What is this? Formalin residue. Preserving the dead with formalin, commonly used as an embalming agent. What's this right? Is this a coffin? Do you want to open the casket? You bet your ass. <laughs> Get a grip, man. The gilded key. Can we go through here? Is this a path? Gate is locked. Will the gilded key be the answer? Can we switch? Excellent. Wait. Some more to explore. Exploring. Do you want to look through the spiral? Yes. The ominous cave. Okay. We still have the key. 
No. Tank controls OMG. Carnby? Carnby, answer me. Aline, I thought you were dead. I did too. I'm not cut out for this kind of place. I want this to stop right now. I understand. You understand? You understand? You don't understand anything. I don't know what you, Johnson, or Professor Morton want of me, but I'm asking for this nightmare to stop right now. Aline, get a grip on yourself. Where are you? Get a grip, woman! No room, but I can't get to you. One of the doors is locked, and I can crack the other one, but there's some heavy object blocking it. When I think it's Obed Morton who locked me in here, and I wanted to help him. Don't move. I'll come free you. Is that the best you can do? Yes, that's the best I can do. Well, okay. Hurry up. <laughs> what do you want, lady? Do you want me to just magically appear? Demons. Oh, God. Shit! <laughs> Ace, triple barrel shotgun justice, demon. Trevor saving. Kirsten lamp. Just an ordinary clock. Nothing suspicious, nothing sketchy there. The ashes are still warm. It's blue. Aline, any more news? I'm here waiting for you. What are you doing? I can't find the room in which you say you're locked up. It can't be that tough. I'm upstairs. There's a staircase in the lobby. Okay, I'll head over there. Thanks. Hurry up. Behind the painting of 
blend in. I think it's just a chest. Seems sealed up. Do we need the small? No, we need the small rusty key. Okay. What's going on? I don't know yet. I have no I idea. Know. I'm outfit. Makes you look less, uh, you know. Yes, I know. <laughs> Here, I got your stuff. Thanks. What about my jacket? Whoever locked you up in here probably thought it matched his hair. Listen, I should never have agreed what to let you What does that come even on. mean, guy? I have my own reasons for being here. Were you able to talk with Obed Morton? No. Were you? I'm not so sure. I have this feeling that there's more than one Obed Morton. It's way too dangerous. We have to find a safe place for you where you can hide and wait for me. Listen, Carnby. You know as well as I do that the safest place is at least two hours away by plane. I haven't done too bad up till now, and I sure don't intend to spend whatever time I have left doing nothing. I want to know. Just before, I heard this voice above us. There's a trap door. If you help me, I can reach it. But why not stick together? You and I don't have the same goals. Remember what you told me in the plane. Come on, give me a hand. What if I were to say no? You're not the type to say no. Dialogue is so bad. Seventeen pages of this crap? I don't not really. It's not the code of the control board in the library. Is that what?
Dennis Corner. I have always wondered about the circle of stones located in the moors. When I would ask Edenshaw about it, he always remained very vague. I now think it's some kind of ritual calendar used to determine various astronomical events. I have started building a planetarium that will be used in conjunction with the circle of stones. All this seems linked to the gate, to the opening of the gate, and to the ritual of the seven statues. Edenshaw was very surprised. It seems he had not thought them related. I therefore talked him into performing the ritual with the ancestors. I know his weakness and how to use it. He wanted to convince me of his powers as a witch doctor. Even he acted out of pride. I recorded him while he spoke the sacred words of his tribe. He was standing before one of the steels, and the direction in which he pronounced the incantation seemed an important part of the ritual. But nothing happened. The time has not yet come. Oh, man.